Welcome, everyone. Our daily prompt today is Othman's Trains. You can find all the prompts detailed at the bottom of the video description. All the images you will see in this video were created using the prompts on the list. We aim to delve into the central theme of each daily prompt and even share some humor to keep things interesting. Today, we've dressed the main theme, Othman's Trains, as a largely imaginative experience without regard to reality. All prompts contain a type of art that is entirely fictitious and not loosely related to reality. You can find all the prompts in the description below. Artistic Variables For today, we've picked two prompts to discuss. Othman's Trains, Archaeology Art, Hyperrealistic, 4K, S200. Othman's Trains, Microbiology Art, Hyperrealistic, 4K, S200. The variable of archaeology art influences the imagery to have ancient ruins and historical elements juxtaposed with modern trains. The microbiology art theme incorporates microscopic organisms like bacteria and viruses, as if they were passengers or elements of the train's design. Each prompt uses hyper-realistic 4K resolution to produce exceptionally sharp images, making it visually striking. Now, let's move on to the history of the Ottomans. The Ottoman Empire was founded around the late 13th century, initially as a small state in Anatolia. Through conquests and diplomatic maneuvers, the empire expanded its territory significantly. One of the pivotal moments was the conquest of Constantinople in 1453, which then became Istanbul. The Ottomans played a vital role in shaping the history of many regions, including Europe, Asia, and Africa. They also left an indelible mark on technology and infrastructure, including the realm of trains. Railways in the Ottoman Empire were initially met with skepticism, but were later adopted for both civilian and military applications, such as the Hejaz Railway meant to facilitate pilgrimage to Mecca. As we were discussing, the Ottomans initially encountered skepticism when introducing railways to their empire. Yet, as they had in so many other areas, they pressed forward, understanding that embracing modern technologies could further solidify their empire's standing. Over time, railways became a significant part of Ottoman infrastructure, both for civilian and military applications, such as the Berlin-Baghdad Railway aimed at connecting Berlin with the then Ottoman city of Baghdad and the Hejaz Railway, designed to facilitate the pilgrimage to Mecca. These feats represented the empire's desire to integrate into the modern world, while also maintaining their distinct identity and strategic interests. Governance and Administration The governance model of the Ottoman Empire was complex and layered, reflecting the diverse communities that it incorporated. The millet system was one such remarkable aspect of its governance. It allowed religious communities to govern themselves under their laws to a large extent, promoting social stability and integration. The Ottoman rulers, usually known as sultans, held executive authority, although a cadre of administrators, most notably the Grand Vizier, assisted them. Cultural Achievements The Ottomans were also patrons of the arts and sciences. The architectural marvels created under the rule of Sultan Suleiman, the Magnificent, like the Suleimaniya Mosque in Istanbul, are an enduring testament to Ottoman grandeur. In literature, the epic poem Book of Didi Korkut is one of the most significant contributions from the Ottoman period. Science and philosophy were other areas where the Ottomans made significant strides, most notably in astronomy and medicine. Military might the Janissaries, elite infantry units that formed the Ottoman Sultan's household troops and bodyguards, were one of the most potent military forces of their time. Trained from childhood and belonging to the Sultan, they were a significant force in expanding and securing Ottoman territories. Their decline, mired in corruption and inefficiency, 
symbolized broader challenges the empire would face. Diplomatic Relations The empire had a complex relationship with neighboring states. At various times, they were at war or in alliances with different European powers. They also held diplomatic ties with Asian states and had a strategic alliance with France against the Habsburgs. These diplomatic endeavors were guided by real politic, often devoid of ideological rigidity, providing them an edge in dealing with complex geopolitical scenarios. Decline and Fall Despite the robustness of its earlier models, the empire couldn't escape the jaws of decline. A series of military failures, internal strife, and the increasing corruption among janissaries and officials weakened the empire. The administrative lapses made it hard to adopt new military technologies, making them increasingly vulnerable to external threats. The empire was officially dissolved in 1922, making way for the modern Republic of Turkey. Legacy The empire has left an indelible mark on the fabric of modern Turkey and the broader Middle East. It has influenced the Islamic world and the West in ways that are both evident and subtle. Whether it's the cuisine, which gave us dishes like kebabs and baklava, or administrative strategies, the echoes of the Ottoman Empire are still discernible today. Conclusion The Ottoman Empire stands as a significant chapter in the annals of history. Its rise and fall provide invaluable lessons on the dynamics of power, governance, and human endeavor. As modern civilizations grapple with the challenges of governance and societal integration, the empire serves as both a mirror and a cautionary tale. And now, let's brighten up the atmosphere with six jokes about the Ottomans. Why did the Ottoman Sultan refuse to play cards? Because he didn't want to deal with any more suits. What was the Ottomans' favorite game? Sultans and ladders. What did the Ottoman chef say? Make the empire great again, one kebab at a time. Why did the Ottoman mathematician get kicked out of school? He kept insisting that pi was actually baklava. How many Ottomans does it take to change a light bulb? Just one, but six viziers have to approve it. What's the Ottoman empire's favorite movie? Gone with the wind, because it's also about an empire that was gone too soon. If you found interest and pleasure in the video we presented today, please click the like button, forward the video to your friends, and subscribe to the channel so that you will be notified of every daily video we produce for the benefit of this innovative field. Thanks. And remember, you too can create amazing visuals that few can match.